Hey guys, it's Blue, and um, I wanted to tell you guys a story that happened. I'm just here with all the, the plushies. Um, we'll get into the story after I show you something. So this is my, this is Pyre, and this is Echo, and this is what um, they look like next to um, Milo, my new husky. Look how big he is. Like, they are so large. And, uh... Yeah, I was pretty surprised by, like, how big he is, but I still really like him. Um, and then, but that's because he's a 22-inch plush. And I think these guys are only, like, 20 inches or something. I don't know. And then I have this dog, too. He's Douglas. So, yeah, Douglas is pretty much always, like, 20 inches, and he's, like, 22. Or, I don't know. Maybe I'm off. Maybe I'm off. Maybe they're supposed to be, like... 18 inches I don't know I don't remember the exact sizing on these guys but I just know that this guy is 22 um so yeah but I was thinking about names today and I was thinking what if I named him Hawk and then what if I named him um Falcon yeah I don't know um and then I, my friend was like making fun of me like why are you naming your dogs after birds and I'm like, because they're my dogs. Anyway, so, anyway, yeah. I can't think of names right now, but I was thinking of that. So, also, I wanted to tell you a story. Um, before I got him and before I got him, um, Lou one day was just minding her own business. And she was just sitting here. She was sitting in her spot, like, up here. And minding her own business right next to River. And... My cat, one of my cats, I think it was Bensie, because I always blame Bensie for everything. Because Bensie's a little twat, okay? Yeah, he is. Anyway, so he was sitting up up there on the top, oop, on the top of the shelf. And he must have been not feeling very well, because he threw up. Yeah, he threw up right up there. And I'll show you exactly what he did, because I was very upset, but... This happened, I don't even know when this happened, but he was, like, laying up here, and then he threw up, and he goes, Bleh! all over this poor dog, all over Spruce, and Spruce had puke, like, all over his head, and then there was also puke right here, like, in a puddle, and then there was also some puke on him, and then, um, there was puke, I guess because she's the only one that sticks out a little bit, if you look down. You can see how she kind of, like, sticks out, right? Well, wait. Yeah, she sticks out, so she had puke, like, all over her head right here. And I was freaking out because Blue is, like, very special to me. And because she's my first prime Sheba plush, and uh, I'm very attached to her. And I can't believe Spruce had puke on him, too. I was like, oh, my God. So I, like, came in here with the wipes, and I was wiping down every plush that had puke on them. And I took her took her over to the bathroom and I took Spruce too and so these two were bathroom buddies because they had to get the puke off of them and I was so mad at Bensie but like I didn't take it out on him because the reason I don't think it was Evie is because Evie usually lays over here she likes to be next to the unicorns she likes hanging out over here this is like her little hangout spot my cats usually hang out in here whenever we sleep in at night because this is where they first got introduced to the house. So this is like the room they're the most comfortable in. And they like all the shelves. So there he is. He is acting like he did nothing wrong. But yeah, he always loves to go way up there because that's the highest shelf in the whole room. So, yeah. And so whenever me and my boyfriend go to sleep over here, we're always sleeping in here. And... They like to go in there in their own little room because they have these, like, big shelves to sleep on. It makes them feel like little kings and queens, you know? So that's why they do that. You're so cute, E.B. You're so cute. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I know it was him because he's the only one that goes up there all the time. And I think it was him. He also pukes a lot because, um, Bensie has a problem where he likes to wolf down his food. He literally wolfs down his food. I feel like he looks at my wolf plushies all the time and he's like, I want to eat like them, you know? And so then he wolfs down his food and he's just, you're crazy. 
but I like you anyway. So yeah, that's basically this, the whole story of what happened. It was like, I was shook, but yeah, so as you can see, um, my plushies are fine. They're unharmed. The puke is off of her head. I did a really good job at removing it. If you need a tip for how to remove puke, puke off of your pet, just p gently wipe them down with like a wipe or if you don't have wipes, then just use a paper towel with, um, with like pet cleaner on it. You can also probably use OxyClean, but I don't know. I, I've always used just wipes or something like that. And you just have to be really consistent and wipe down, wipe them down like over and over and over again. Also wipe them the opposite direction and then wipe them back. Because there's probably like first hiding under there. And you have to get all of it. Or puke hiding under the Yeah. <clears throat> this is gross to think about, but it's like, you know, I care about my plushies a lot. And uh, I take good care of them. They, I mean, they always sit up there. Like, these guys, these guys have always been sitting there. And they've been sitting there for a long time. My webkins. I think it's, like, crazy. Like, how many webkins I have. Does anybody else think I'm crazy? Like, I think sometimes I look at my webkins and I'm like, look how crazy I am. With all the brown dogs. Also, Bensi likes to come over to my brown dogs and specifically go after the ones on the left. And then he likes to go over here to uh, to these raccoons and go after them. And then he likes to go after the, like these poor girls, or like these guys, these ones on the ground. Like, why does he like to go after like the specific ones every single time? Is that just a thing that cats do? I think cats like they get into such a habit. They get into a little habit where they just do the same thing. Like, they just do the same thing every day, and they constantly just fuck with the same shit every single day like like clockwork right Bensi? you just love to fuck with the same shit every day yeah so anyway that's pretty much it guys i hope you enjoyed today's video um let me know if you want more stories <laughs> i'll make more but yeah so thanks for watching bye i'm gonna make i'm gonna make him do a flip since he's a new new boy Woo!